Hi guys, William Morris here, and today I wanted to do something just a little bit different and take a look at ultra-wide monitors uh, for use in a door. So I have Cubase up in front of me, and this is what it looks like on a 34-inch ultra-wide monitor. This one's an LG, and has a resolution of 2560 by 1080. So my previous setup was uh, three monitors across the same desk, and they were 22-inch 1080p monitors. Now this does give you a huge amount of uh, screen space with, with three, uh, but what you find is that with one central small monitor, your project window, like uh, the one that's up at the minute, actually becomes quite small. So I decided to switch to an ultra wide so I could have a, a really big project window, a nice big piano roll. Uh, what I want to do next is actually put in another monitor up above this one for things like video and maybe the mix window in Cubase. But enough talk, let's uh, have a look and see how Cubase looks in, a, in an ultra wide. I imagine this would also look pretty similar in other doors like Logic and Pro Tools, etc. So this is our project window. And as you can see, you get a lot of uh, horizontal space for your track. This one's around 2 minutes 40 and the whole thing fits on really easily at this stage and you can still see the, the MIDI information data on some of the tracks as well. The other great thing is the size of the piano roll I and mean, being able to see all your MIDI notes really clearly and especially for long sequences. So let's just take a look at one of those. So for me, going from a 22-inch monitor and just a standard aspect ratio, uh, this kind of gives me at least double the the amount of uh, horizontal screen space, which is obviously really nice. The only downside is uh, with obviously the one screen setup going from three is that you now have to start to open multiple windows on top of each other to see things like the uh, the mix console. So this is my group track view, which I'm just going to zoom into. And let's have a look at a track view. So it's great for things like the mixer page. Uh, you can really get a whole load of channels on in one go. But like I say, with the one monitor setup, obviously you need to open multiple windows. So I think really for a setup this size, having maybe a monitor above would just allow you to uh, and maybe the mixer page up, or if you do video work, to have a video up, or maybe something like a sampler, or a contact, or a synth open at the same time. And these monitors are also great for editing work. Uh, if you use things like Premiere or uh, Final Cut or things like that, you get really do get a lot of like timeline space to kind of see your project all in one go. I think ideally, if I had a bigger desk and a bigger room, it'd be amazing to have uh, three ultra wide monitors spread out and then speakers in behind. But I think for now, this setup, and uh, once I get a monitor in above uh, that I can put video on as well, it's going to be sort of a nice sweet spot for me at the minute. I'll put a link down in the description to this particular model of monitor if you want to check it out in more detail. Obviously, there's other options as well, some that are higher resolution. But if you guys have any additional questions, uh, just let me know in the comments, and I'll be happy to uh, answer any of them.